No wonder my nose was sore where my glasses sit. I have a scratch on it. Ouch. Oh. Did you accidentally scratch yourself? Or? Probably. No, oh. me. I might have to put my sweater back on. That's like me. I'll get like really hot and then I'll take something off and I get cold. It's again. called hot flashes. <laughs> oh. uh, no, I should have gone further. Let me see. Oh, that's the same as the bottom one. I know. Okay. So we have to go a bit further. Yep. Oh. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Okay. All right, just well, let me, um, I need to make some more paper. Or... I made paper, it's in the chest. Am I going to lose my compass now to this? Make another compass. I picked up some more redstone. Here, look, you can have. I found it in the cave. <laughs> I'm officially out of. Okay. It's behind oh. you. And oh, past. thank you. Let me grab some iron. Yeah, that was a good cave. I found all kinds of things. We'll have to go back there if I remember where it was. I mean, I took my horse, so it can't be that far. Oops. Let me, oh. Hi, <clears> kids. <throat> oh, the door's open. <laughs> yes, I did leave the door open. There you go. Um, okay. I need to eat. Okay. All right. Are you flying again? Yeah. <laughs> so you went not far enough then? Um, no. I need to go more to the right. So you need to go more over here. You can see my glow. Yep, I'm following you. I was like, I thought that was a polar bear, but it's a sheep. All right, let me put this. Hmm. <clears throat> Do you think I'm far enough? <gasps> There's bunnies over here. Do you think I'm far enough? Um, I'll put my sweater on. You're not opening it up? What? And then running? Wait, what? Excuse me? No, I, I, never mind. <clears throat> I said you're not opening the map. I haven't done the right click yet. And then run to see where you are. Oh. <laughs> but, oh. Oh. Well, I'm definitely north. Up where that uh, was. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I'm definitely to the left of the other one. Okay. So I'm kind of, I think I'm off the map. Because I'm just a dot now. I'm not a... Oh, okay. I'm not so an arrow. A more left or a little more right? I think I need to go this way a little bit. Yeah. <clears throat> now I'm in the middle of the map. Okay. And I'm off the map, so... Oh, there's a polar bear over here, too. You don't have a baby, though. Oh, well, there's two over here. They, they... Should I go back yeah. until I have an arrow? You can't read them. Oops. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's a bee over here. Excuse me. Bee. Yeah. I saw him. I've been trying to get bees to go back. And he's like, he doesn't care. Come on. Look. Look. Yes. Follow me. Come on. Yes. I'm flying. Let's go. Come on. Here we go. We're flying. Let's go. No, no, no. Don't lose interest. It's not like, hello. Bee. bee. Thank you. Come on. Yes. Let's go. I'm going back until I have a point. I, I was on my horse when I found a bee, and oh, I had to actually literally walk backwards with my horse. All right, I'm right on the edge of the map, right here. Because my horse was so fast, the bee kept losing interest. 
So I'm going to go right here because I'm, look at that polar bear down there. This looks the same. You're kidding. No. And I was right on the edge of the, it's like it's redrawing the same map over and over. And maybe it's because I was too close to it. <sighs> I think there's a, there has to be a bug with the maps. I swear. I'm going to, uh, come on. I'm going to run farther this time. Instead, of, see if a instead of going here, back to the edge it. of the map. Thank you. I am going to, um, there goes my comp my next compass. Ugh. All right. I'm going to go the equivalent to half the map. Oh, the oh. bee went inside the beehive. Oh, good. I should have done it where I was, but I questioned myself. I shouldn't have. Okay, I'm just waiting for these bees to come back out so I can breed them so they don't fly away. I got them back here. <laughs> okay, I'm practically at the village over here. Oh. Yeah, my horse was just too fast. This poor bee kept losing interest, so I had to walk backwards the whole way. Yeah. You, you know when you saw that bee before in the icy mm -hmm. area? Yeah, it was way over there. <sighs> so annoying. And, and I had to walk backwards on your bridge, on my horse. I'm surprised I didn't fall off. Now, I don't think I would get a cabin. I would just have like a seat, but the seats recline and stuff. Mm -hmm. I mean, it would be fine. Mark hasn't done any research yet on it. Toronto to Vancouver, but I, I wouldn't go there. No, you have to get off in Edmonton. Yeah. But that would work out perfect. I mean, yes, I could take a flight to Edmonton, but we'd already be there. Would you fly that, home? I'd probably fly home, yeah. Then you could fly either Calgary or Edmonton, depending on whichever is cheaper. Yeah. I'm not going to get the last corner of this map, I'm fairly certain. I'm very fairly sure. Oh, it's kind of, but you can well, tell Toronto, I would, you I'd can... have to go to Toronto all the way to Edmonton. So it goes through Sudbury, Sioux Lookout, Winnipeg, Saskatoon, and then Edmonton. Mm -hmm. Wearing a mask is no longer mandatory. Thank goodness. I Both sleepers class cabins for one and cabins for two only. Economy classes, prestige, and berths are currently offered. Seating passengers will have access to common spaces. The dining car will be available using a reservation system for sleeper plus passengers. Reservations are required for lunch and dinner. Dining car will be open to sleeper plus passengers. Only. Oh, right. I'm in creative. <laughs> like, wait. At seat cart. Yeah, that's what I would have. At seat food card. I wouldn't mm -hmm. want to go into the dining car anyway. Just stay in my seat. Uh, we will continue to offer our standard menu items, but you may be required to modify certain offerings in order to better serve you during this time. Sleeper Plus passengers will be able to access to the common showers by reserving a time. Showers will be sanitized after each use. I don't know if I would shower though, even if it's a couple days. I don't think you'd have to. Um, I have showers as soon as you got here. You could have a nice long hot shower. Four nights and four days for that whole trip. How much? Four nights and four days. Ooh. All the way to Vancouver, though. Oh, okay. So Edmonton is like. It Two stops it, before that. Yeah. So, and they take it they're slow through the mountains? Might go two days. Um, explore Canada by train, Western Canada, Toronto, Vancouver, train, there classes and services. I think I already looked at that. Okay. I'm going into creative again. And then they have a sightseeing car. That's so cool. It is. There's, um, a guy on YouTube, Downey Live. He oh. does trains all the time. 
There's another guy too, Francis something or other. He's British and he always he's like a train fanatic and I followed him because he's Oops. just he's as excited, I think, of my dad, thinking of my dad when he was young. Yeah. It would be like <clears throat> and he and his girlfriend or sorry, now fiance, they take the trains all the time. And he gets so excited when he sees the train. It's like it's really cool. So economy, let's see. Oh shoot. What did I do? I hate the iPad sometimes. I scroll out of it. Oops. Apparently, I can't be in creative. Let the motion of the train rock you to sleep while you glide through the wilderness. Extra blankets and pillows can be purchased. By day, in addition to your roomy seat and the friendly atmosphere, you'll have access. To... See, we're also thinking that it would be more comfortable for my fat butt to sit in a train seat than a plane seat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Choose from a selection of affordable meals. It's definitely be easier to get up and walk around. Mm hmm. And, oh, polar bears. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I don't know if I lucked out this time doing game mode. If I did it right or not. We'll see. Or in game mode. In creative. <laughs> we used to take the train all the time when I was a kid to go to Moosonee when we were sh um, stationed there. So you would, there were no cars. You'd have to ship your car. It was like $100 to ship your car. And Moosney's up oh. on the James Bay. I can take it from Oakville if I want it. Really? It's just the next town over. Still. Oakville via. And if I take it. So if I go to Union, though, that was probably the actual Canadian. Is that weird yeah. because I. Uh... Edmonton. Departure date would be what? There we go. There we go. What date would that be? I'd be Sorry? leaving. What? Oh, uh, the the fourth. Huh? The fourth, because the third we'd be driving back doing the Jasper Rocky Mountains, and then no, you... no, 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 the day to to leave here. Oh, you could do um to get here. Do you, you want me? Do you your want? Birthday. I would like you here for my birthday, but that would like be you'd be here a week, and then you would be also two to three days travel. So you're looking at ten days at least. Yeah. Is that a little long for you to be away from home? No. Okay. I'm just thinking of cost wise, but so if I leave, say it takes, I don't know, if I go on the Friday, the twenty fifth. And then I'm not doing a return date, so I'm going to search. Yeah, you're like a one way. A return date? Oh, for fuck's sake. I have to put a return date. It's dark <laughs> outside. <laughs> Are you out floating on the, up in the sky? <laughs> yes. Hang on, let me put my bed down. <clears throat> I'm sleeping. Okay. Where'd my love black? I don't need to put a return date because I just didn't put how many people. Um, yeah, you should be able to put like one way. And I'm going to do one people. One people. Wanting me to put a return date in. Why is this one blank? Okay. Oh, because I was in creative. Service not available on the date requested. Okay, so you have to work around that. The only date offered now is the 27th, the day before your birthday. Oh, well, we'll have to celebrate after then. 